Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me again. I am Hatch and today we're back attacking Tell Me Why. Last episode, poor sad Allison here. We we confirmed Sam is not our dad. Kinda knew that already. Uh and you this should try to do this again while I'm still in town. Yeah. For sure. Mike and Tyler had a date. Now. Fishing on buzzard hey, hole. I think I'll just show myself out. Later, Mike. Okay. Sorry. Don't be. I'll see you two later. Be good. Sorry for what? We had a good time. Awkward. Awkward. Someone say something. Sorry for interrupting. Good job, Ellie. <laughs> no, it's totally fine. We were done anyway. I'm fished out. Ellie, you good? Catch anything? What? It's mostly time. ice, but yeah. Mostly ice? Huh. Tyler. <laughs> I'm sorry for freaking out yesterday. All of this... It's just been really hard on me. I understand. Don't apologize. I was being an asshole. Yeah, you were. I should have never pushed you that hard. Asshole. <laughs> Come here. Oh, Hug it out. Yes. We're good. Now, about those memories. <laughs> Let's do it again. Gosh, why did I miss you so much? It's been a day, Alan. It's only been a day. <laughs> I've been told I have that effect on people. You're smothering you dumb, them. Dumb. You dumb dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I need to show you something. I'm ready. What? You're kind of weirding me out. A little bit. Can we sit down for a sec? Lead the way. Ah, oh, that's a good spot. Spill it, Allie. So, what is it? I was just at Sam's. He's not our father. <laughs> How do nope. you know? I asked him, point blank. Pretty bluntly. Yeah, Arson's definitely not his style. I'm not surprised. Running down the barn didn't really seem like a Sam move. Yeah, I guess it was silly to suspect him in the first place. Right, he built the thing. <laughs> He'd never hurt Mary Ann's kids. There's something else. There's a hidden Look room. Look at this. This was taken in 1992 when Mary Ann first moved to Delos Crossing. Ah, uh, 92. See that ladder? Look. Sam told me the barn has a loft. He helped her build it. Apparently, she never told anyone about it. And it's still there? As far as he knows, yeah. What do you think? Let's do it. Should we give it a shot? Yeah, let's check it We've out. We've come this far. And a hidden loft? That's got secret shit written all over right. it. Right. Let's go. I mean, we, we're going to have to up the value on the, uh, the Zillow price for the house. Now that we know there's an extra loft upstairs. That's a clubhouse waiting to happen. I guess it makes sense why we never saw it. I think it's like up above the... Uh, the old truck in here. Ugh, what a mess. Ugh. That's not gonna help us get this house sold. There it is. Yeah, we got our deadbeat dad to thank for that. Thanks, dad. So obviously the ladder's gone, but what about that handle? Is it still here somewhere? Hmm. What do you think is up there? I don't know. I'm trying not to speculate. My brain was going to some real dark places. Yeah, it was. I saw it. <laughs> um, I'll protect you, Allie. You'll be okay. Don't worry. Whatever's up there, I'll protect you. We'll see how chivalrous you feel when you've got bats in that perfectly coiffed hair. Ooh, got him. Yes, I'm glad someone finally, finally gets Tyler for his hair. Because, <laughs> let's face it, it's beautiful. <laughs> I'm jelly of the hair. Alright, so, we're looking for a handle. We gotta get a handle on this handle situation. Boo this man. Um, da, 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 nothing over here. Allie, where is it? Allie? I, look, I'm not going to tell you this again. If you don't help me look for stuff instead of just standing... <laughs> we, we talked about this, Allie. You can't just stand there and make no me do everything. <laughs> Man, this place is a mess. If there was ever a time to find a magic portal. Ooh. I mean, I get it. You've been going through some stuff. I but... thought I saw something right over here, but... Guess my mind's just playing tricks on me. What? I thought I found something in the garage, but it must have been an illusion. <laughs> just a regular old light switch. <laughs> just electricity. Nothing to see here. Nothing here. Just bleach. Hey, what is that? 
For a second, I thought there might be another secret stash down here, but... But... Uh, just a loose plank. Ah, uh, just a plank. The handle should be behind this. Really? Behind what? Aha! Look at that! Ah, uh, there it is. Very secretive. <laughs> it's opening up! The secret keeper always did store all the best secrets in the clouds. Yep. Come on, let's find a way to climb up there. On top of the truck. Just here, let me show you how. You get on the hood, right here. Come on, Tyler. Hut. Get up there. Um, uh, fine. How about this thing? Can I use it? Allie, what do you think? How are we gonna get up there? Well, that's way too high to jump. You wanna give me a leg up? Ooh, booster. I'm so not touching your nasty shoes. We'll find a ladder. And shout out to Allie's nasty shoes. Who knew? Allie got the dirty boots. My favorite Sonic Youth song, by the way. Is Sonic Youth still relevant? Who knows, but is this really what's in the top of the barn? What the hell is this? Looks like a sacrificial altar or some shit. Can you see anything? Yeah, I see a lot, man. Nope. Not a... Mama's on some weird shit, man. Also, it's been a long time. Those glow-in-the-dark stars would not hold <laughs> luminescence any longer. Those things work for like two years tops. <laughs> Careful, Allie. Here, found, found a it. switch. <gasps> dun dun dun! The hunter. How'd you get up here? Huh? Oh, oh shit! <laughs> so, oh. <laughs> well, that shaved a few years off my life. Yeah. Look at him. Just cheesing. Yeah. <laughs> Is that the official hunter voice? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, your mom, Allison. Yeah. <laughs> whoa. Yeah, whoa. This is where mom used to go to lose her shit while y'all were asleep. <laughs> it's... It's weird. Her story. Look. She left us something. Oh, no. Fuck you, Marianne. Why would you leave me a puzzle box? <laughs> it's got a combination uh, lock with letters. Masochistic bitch. Do you think she hid the code somewhere in all this? Yeah, guaranteed. Knowing Marianne, probably. <laughs> well, you want to do this? Fine. Yeah, let's start here. All right, so let's, let's take, uh... Uh... Take a look and see what we got here. Let's look at the puzzle box Do first. Do you have any idea what the code might be? Right. No. So we just got three so symbols. So we should probably see if Marianne hid anything before we go trying to guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. Calm down. So we got symbols that are red, symbols that are kind of tannish orange, and we got cream symbols. So the numbers definitely are going to coincide with something. Uh, so remember that red, tan, cream. So we, are, we got a cream wall, like a tan wall there. This looks pretty red. Um, all right. See what Recognize this? Yeah. It's from the story where the goblins tricked the Mad Hunter. It looks like it, but it's different, right? Mm. Can you check the book? Look at all these things to click on. That's ridiculous. All right, back to the book of goblins. Uh, all right, so it's about the what now? The Mad Hunter story over here. Uh, the Mad Hunter gets his hat back. Well, there's two Mad Hunter stories. There's this one and oh, this is here it. Here it is. Why do you think she changed the picture? I don't know. So what's missing? Maybe it's a message. Like, the differences between the two mean something. Makes sense. Mm, something about Marianne, right? All right, so that's the only picture, luckily. Uh, maybe we can solve this without reading the whole thing. So we got the hunter, the two goblins. They're tossing Marianne into the lake. It looks like the hunter is catching her once she's in the lake. The moon is directly above, and that's kind of it. Okay, right, so spot the differences. Moon's directly above. Uh, there's no Marianne. Yep, see Marianne's over here, and there's no goblins. So that's it different. Moves. Oh, some of these parts are buttons. Yep. So you go down here. The Mad Hunter still has two hands here. 
So this was either before the gold lady cut off his other one, or after he earned it back? Which either makes it before most of the stories, or after. Yeah, at some point when she was running away from whatever the hell the mad hunter meant to Marianne. Alright, so the castle was definitely not there. Why do you think she added that castle in the background? See the color of the flag? It could be her mother's castle. It looks like the princess is running away from it. So Marianne ran away from home, and she grew up kind of rich? Hmm. Uh, let's see. There's no goblins. Huh. No goblins. Yeah. In the original, the goblins managed to save the princess from the Mad Hunter. So we saved Marianne from something, but not in this version? Alright, so I don't think this blue leaf was here. Uh, yeah, it is. Blue, purple, uh, what else are we missing? Tree. Anything different about the hunter? No, the hunter looks the same. Uh, what's this up here? That, oh, yeah, there's an extra star. You see that? No, there isn't. Um, not seeing anything else that's really different. We all good here? Figured anything out yet? I mean, it looks right to me. Oh, I guess we haven't figured it all out yet. Nah, still <laughs> figuring it out. Alright, so... What's this over here? Just purple? No, it's still there. Blue. Castle. Ah, maybe the, uh, once upon a time there was a young princess. Okay, yeah, the, uh, title's different. It's not the same title, so I guess that counts as a difference. Ta-da! That's it. Whoa. What's in there? Pictures, letters. Have you ever seen any of these? All the pictures of Marianne I've ever seen were the ones hanging on the walls. All right, so we got a collectible. The gold lady. Let's grab that. That was definitely her mom. So did Marianne grow up kind of rich? Maybe. Would have been nice to have some of that. Amen. An artsy environmentalist. Yep, that sounds like Marianne's exact kind of catnip. <laughs> What is this, her transcripts? Why, Did you know she studied engineering? So why are these no. in here? It, it looks like she changed her major to visual arts. I don't think she actually got it changed. The paper's not signed and it's all wrinkled. Hmm. Like someone tried to throw it away. So she went to Berkeley. Brent? Oh, his name is Brent? That doesn't sound like a cool guy. Hmm, what does Brent sound like? <clears throat> Marianne, I, I can't do this anymore. You deserve better than that cliche bullshit like it's not you, it's me. But the truth is, it's all just been too much to deal with. And I'm realized I'm just not right. Yeah, Brent's a tool. I don't even want to read the rest of this. Uh, damage is done. So sorry. You're an amazing person. Yeah, we're breaking up. All right, got it. <laughs> Could this guy have been any more cryptic? No. <laughs> he sounds like an asshole. Wow, Brent. I don't think I've ever seen a picture of her that young. Aww. I think that's her mom in the background. Definitely. Look at her judging even us. <laughs> the golden lady was rough. Aww, Aww. poor thing. Despite all her rage. Old drawing of a pet in here? Still just Polly in a cage. I can't believe she was a ballet dancer. Marianne. And a good one, too. God, that's so not her. I mean, she's got one first place trophy. I guess that means you're good. I'll take it. Uh, I think that's it. All right. Tyler, see that little light? I think we need to solve this one next. Okay. <laughs> this little light of mine. Who built this? Look at this obtuse bullshit, Marianne. <laughs> you weirdo. <laughs> There's the gold lady again. Oh. She's all over the board. Yeah, she is. There was a figure of her in that stash by the Mad Hunter painting, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So maybe all of this is related to what we found in there. Okay. So her cruel parents kept her locked away in the rusty palace. All right, so um, on this one, she's shooing away something. 
So I'm assuming she was shooing away the bird? Hey, I can move the piece next to the gold lady. All these pictures. Because she, she was upset about They look about like it. images from Marianne's life before Delos, yep. don't they? Well, some of them do anyway. Maybe that's it then. We need to figure out which ones are real. All right, so here she is being judgmental about her ballet. The princess dancing, playing violin, spinning wool. I guess this is stuff she did mm -hmm. for fun. Yep. Notice how unhappy she looks in all these pictures. I don't think she was having any fun. All right, so this one is a little confusing. Um, so I guess this is... Oh, I see. So this is Marianne doing her away from something. So this would be the law. She didn't go to law school. That would be money, um, medicine, and engineering. Uh, yeah, I think it would. There we go. The wise princess looks like she's trying to run away. And she's being watched by the gold lady. Yep. Hmm. So her mom wanted her to go to art school, not engineering. Um, and what is Brent down here? Brent's an artist, right? Yep. There we go. What's the gold lady do? Is that it? Yeah, of it's course opening. that's it. Come on, baby. I know how to do puzzles. What's in there this time? Uh, let's see. Sarmonberry Park in Kodiak Island. Um, Eco Village. Oh, okay. That's where she met Brent, I suppose. Well, there's a lot going on here. Sarmonberry Park. Huh. Is that some kind of commune? Definitely. Looks like it. So weird to imagine her living in a community like that with, you know, other people. The weirdest part is how they all seem to love her. Where was prom queen Marianne when the whole town was turning on us? So it looks like she made some friends there. I was kind of reading it while they were talking. Nothing terribly important there. Wishing her the best and saying she had good berry picking skills. Her father. Wow. This is... This one is deep. So, from May of 1996. Um, da, 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 da. Okay, dad can't find her. Uh, send it to your auntie. Uh, oh, I'm writing to inform you that your mother passed away last week. We just had her funeral reception. The house has been filled with people all day. Friends, family, colleagues, and church members. It's now 11 p.m. and I'm sitting alone at the kitchen table, surrounded by dozens of trays of food, flowers, and sympathy cards. All right, we have no idea who Marianne's dad is, but I'm already feeling so sorry for this poor guy. Uh, like, his wife just died, his daughter ran away to a commune, he doesn't know how to get a hold of her. This poor dude. Your cousin Aidy brought in a beautiful photo album of some of our holiday pictures. Uh, you're there in all of them, but you weren't here today. We haven't heard from you in four years. Wow can only hope you made it to Alaska or wherever you are and that you and your child are both safe. Child? Child, not children. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, your mother's been sick and depressed for you. Oh my gosh, this is hard to read. Um, no one, oh my god, it's spread through her. Jeez, come on. Uh, mother's duty doesn't end when her children leave home. Now that you're a mother yourself, I hope you will begin to understand that good parenting isn't about coddling children. It's about providing for them and shaping them into people they're supposed to become, whether they like it or not. Uh, say it, Keenan Ivory Wayans. Message! I won't trouble you again. You've made your intentions clear. I just thought you should know. Dad. Aw. That, that poor what the dude. hell? Marianne was pregnant in 1992. Mm -hmm. With child. Before she even got here. Not children. Before us. Do we have a long lost sibling out there somewhere? It's possible, but she could have given it up or miscarried. Who knows? Hmm. Yeah, you're right. Do you think we could track down her father? You mean the grandfather she never told us about? Google. I don't think I want to. Why? You're not at all excited about having more family. Yeah. You saw the letter. I don't think we want any part of Come that. Come on, it wasn't that bad. Fine. Let's keep digging. Yeah, we definitely have a third sibling. Do you think the Mad Hunter is like the abandoned child wow. who lives in the woods? She worked for a watchmaker in Juno before she moved to Delos. No wonder she was so handy. Uh, here's my Delos Crossing pal's number. I'll let him know you were interested in the house he's selling. Oh, okay. That's when we first got here. Oops. Wow. Wrong one. 
She worked for a watchmaker wow. in Juno before she... Is that Carol? <laughs> yeah, and Sam. Oh. Look at him. He's so young. And happy. And happy. And drinking water. <laughs> That's not our Sam. Alright, all done here. Where to now, Allie? Oh, of course, this obtuse thing this right here. This just lit up, so I think we're supposed to try this one next. What's this? Hmm. Some sort of map? One day she took her tiara and ran away to the forest. Okay. So is this, I guess this is where we start. Oh, okay, we're, this is her life. All right, so she ends up in Delos. She was a watchmaker in Juno before she moved there. She starts at the castle and lived at the commune. So it's going to be castle, commune, watchmaker, house. Got it. So uh, do we have to select this first? This looks like a dinner party with the old bear and the very old beaver. Yeah, that's going to be last. So we're going to deselect that. Okay, so it's going to be castle. That's the gold lady's castle. Okay, and then commune. What's that plant thing on top? Oh, those are definitely salmonberry flowers. Hey, that degree in outdoor studies is paying off. Yeah. And then watchmaker. Some sort of clock. And then... This looks like a dinner party dinner with party. the old bear and the very old beaver. And then Dallas Cross. This is the princess's... Hmm. Nope. It seems like it's not doing anything. Yeah, I think... Maybe it's broken? No, I think we just need to save the middle for last. This is the princess's house. This looks like a dinner party with the old bear and oh. the very old beaver. Done. Yes. What's in there? Another letter? Oh yeah, this one's really long too. <laughs> the princess's loss. Is this from the Book of Goblins? Not definitely. that I know of. Well, sure looks like it could be. It definitely is. Alright, so next episode we read this uh, 17 paragraph letter and let's see if we can figure out what's in the box. Later. The best of me. Don't, don't, don't.